What is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're playing some more Final Night Champion. Today we are fighting someone very higher up in the ranks than us, Ronnie Lopez. He is an inside fighter. It's going to be a very interesting matchup. Jose Luis is back in the ring, ready to showcase his skills for you guys. We're going to see how it goes. It is a sixth round. Oh, he's rocked already. That is a very good sign. And he's down already, Jose Luis. Maybe he does have some power. Beautiful left hand there. Clips the chin. He's down with the first punch. Ronnie, Luis, uh, Ronnie Lopez even. He's, um, he's higher up in the rankings. He actually called out uh, Jose Luis. And that is what we're seeing here. He's going to bang the body. We're not going to like try and steamroll him. I'm trying to just rip him. And uh, trying to make it a nice fight. I've changed his style. He is now a slick style. And I think it kind of goes with his like punch style. The way he moves. He's a very, he's kind of slick. He, he, he's not really the slickest of boxers, but he's okay, man. He can move. He can, he can box very well. He's just got that Mexican style, man. He just likes to walk you down as well. He's, he's got a little bit of everything. He's not great at one thing. He's just a boxer that is just well-rounded. He's not amazing at everything. He's not a good counter puncher. He's not a hard puncher. Um, he's not quick. He's, uh, he's just good at everything. He's okay. He's a little bit quick. He's a little bit strong. He's got nice movement. He can block. Nice combinations. You know, he's not hes not out of this world at everything. And we're going to see how that goes. Maybe a well-rounded fighter is what we need to maybe get a very nice career. But there we go. He's stunned again. Louise is going for it. And he gets held on there. There we go. Lopez holding on, trying to see it through to the next round. But Jose Louise moving well. Ripping the body. So I changed his punch style, I believe, and I changed his stance, and we're already seeing a lot more punches land. Maybe it's just his reach, but I don't know. Some Something I wanted to do with Jose is uh, he, he has a very nice jab, and uh, I'm going to use that jab at, like tenfold. Beautiful overhand, cracks Lopez there. I'm trying to just go to the body a little bit with that jab. There we go, beautiful boxing from Louise here. That is what we're seeing, busting up Lopez. This could be over very soon. Nice uppercut. Tries it again. Tries the left hand there. There we go. A nice first round. Definitely a win for uh, Jose. Let's go again. Let's go again. Only another six rounder, so we haven't really got to worry. I believe we've got enough stamina to be able to finish this guy. I believe we can just walk forward. I want to take him into deep waters, but we've already rocked him and dropped him as well. We've rocked him twice, I believe. So we're just going to fight. We're just going to see how it goes, man. I'm not going to look for the knockout, but if it does present itself, I'll be there to finish it. So we'll see. He's getting cracked at the minute, but he's answering back with some nice counter punches too. This guy, like I said, is an inside fighter. Nice body shots there from Louise. Holding on. Shoved him off. Nice left hand there from Jose. Picking that jab in his face. Overhand there. Slips the left hook, though. Nice movement there from Lopez. And he's got Louise in the corner. That is fine, though. Louise is a very decent boxer. He can definitely survive here. And somewhat outscore. So that is what we're seeing at the minute. He's busting up Lopez to the body, too. Nice uppercut lands. Nice jab through the guard. There we go. Just going to take our time. Just going to try and box nicely. Nice uppercut there to the body. Going to try and box smart. Slipping them left hands. When he dips, I'm looking to slip them left. Like that. There we go. Nice. Okay, he's holding on. You know what? We're going to let him. We're going to get that stamina back. He has got so much less stamina than I have. It's that body work from Jose, man. Lovely hook to the head there. Three, four punches there. Landed. Poor Jose. Fighting smart. Ripping these shots. Oh, nice left hand from Lopez, though. Both of these men are swinging. That's something we're seeing early. We're seeing that Luis can be here. And if he's fighting someone like a Canelo or a Sugar Ray Robinson, it's going to be very hard for him. I think he's going to have a bad time. But there we go. Another good round for Jose Luis. Let's go again. Nice drop to the body there. I think we get the knockout soon. I think we're just too powerful. Look like Jose, obviously in the first punch of the fight, my guy dropped him. Oh, big shot. Big overhand. Jose swinging for the fences now, looking for that stoppage. Nice body work there. Lopez covering up. Jose backs off, trying to fire off that jab. Beautiful boxing in this one so far. 
Feint him, nice. Trying to wait for him to come back in. He's hurt, man. He is so tired, too. Louise just wearing him down in there. Ripping the body. Trying to rip the body because he loses a lot of stamina. And then come back upstairs. Nice jab as he's backing away there as well from Jose. Let's go. Beautiful combination so far. This guy is higher ranked than Jose as well. So. And we're seeing utter domination. Nice double jab. Triple. Slips the uppercut. Very nice boxing so far from Jose Luis, man. He's fought very nicely. Backing him up against the ropes. Ripping the body. Nice left hand. There we go. I feel like a lot of Jose's knockouts may come late. Then again, I'm going to say that now and we'll probably knock him out in the next punch. So, I don't really know. I just feel like they're going to come late. I feel like we're going to try and drag him into deep waters, tie them out, go to the body quite a lot early and then finish him later on. But this dude, I've got to give credit. This dude has a... Uh, He's ate some shots tonight, man. He has ate a lot of shots. Jose looking good. Probably his best performance so far. I believe it's just because the guy called him out and Jose wanted to prove a point that you don't mention his name. He's a freaking beast. A 20-year-old freaking animal, man. And the middleweight division is in trouble if this dude makes it up the ranks. He, they really are. There we go. And nice round from Jose Luis there. One percent recovery on the stamina. That is not good. But we only have, I think, three more rounds. So... It is a six rounder, so yeah, we, we, we're not doing too bad, man. Round four now. Okay. Nice slip there. That was nice. Just gotta watch the stamina. I don't really want to gas out. I just want to box. If we knock him out, we knock him out. If we don't, then that is fine too. Nice straight. Trying to land these big shots. Beautiful boxing from Jose. Oh, an uppercut clips him. And a left hook sends it down. Beautiful combination from Jose Luis. And he is down. Beautiful shot there. The uppercut was nice, man. He came in with his head down. Just a little slip of an uppercut there. And we land the big shot. Lopez is down. And is he going to be able to beat the count? We're going to find out. Has he got the heart? He called out Jose. And it has all gone wrong for him tonight. He gets back up. Luis slipping the jab. Nice left. Comes back in with the hook there. And then a shot to the body. Oh, he's done. He's done. Beautiful left hand drops him. He is out, man. That should be all she broke. Could it be a fourth round stoppage? I don't know. Maybe he gets up. I don't think he will. No, he isn't beating the count. Jose Luis has done it. He has a big win against a higher ranked opponent in the fourth round with a beautiful knockout there. That was really good. That was really good. I didn't want to pressure. I didn't want to do like a baby Wilson and just completely pressure and try and dominate. I wanted to kind of box, move well, and uh, try and score some knockouts like that. But there we go. Another knockout. 4-0 with three knockouts. Very decent record. And we are higher up in the ranks now. We are ranked 36 already. That was our full fight. That's crazy. I'm going to do them more often. I believe a lot of you guys want to see us uh, do stuff like this. Like replace an injured fighter. Uh, okay. Spiro Wolfcott. Okay. Um... Okay, is he... Okay, I don't really want to replace an injured fighter. I want to get people like, hey, I've got to pick for us. What's this? Okay. What, he wants to fight you? Okay, he's a little outside of your comfort zone in the rankings. Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go. I'm taking on all these higher... Hard, I can't even speak. Harder fights. He's 24 and 10. He's 31. Let's go. He's 0 and 5 in his last five. He's going to get smoked. Jose Luis ready to do it again, man. Let's just go and try and take this man out. He's a tall dude. This is going to be a tough one. It's going to be tough. This dude is walking forward, throwing a lot of combinations. Jose Luis is going to need to be a smart boxer here, man. But we're in the Aragon Ballroom for the first time. I believe it is in England, so... I'm going to stick with a jab. It's going to be a chess match. I can already tell. He's going to need to leave with a jab. He's the actual taller fighter. He's got a longer reach. So we can get in on the inside and bust him up there, but... He's high ranks. So this is a tougher fight for Jose. Ripping the body there. Nice. Holding on already, really? Jose doing that nice jab work there. Boxing well on the outside, to be honest. Slipping his head nice, blocking well. I don't want to gas out. A dude like this is going to be a nightmare for us if we gas out. So, just looking to box smartly, I think. Not use too many, uh, too many shots. Just when I do, I want him to land, obviously. Nice jab there to the body. 
trying to fight smart, man. That's all we're trying to do. Lovely straight counter there from Jose. Let's go. There we go. Just really using the jab, really. And everything else. If he comes in and opens up, big, big straight there for Britain. That was nice. Jose Luis ate it, though. Didn't care. I feel like we've been the better fighter, especially this round. Just sitting on the outside. Don't really want to push forward because I'm playing into his game, you know? Nice right hand there. Bit down on that one. It feels like every fight in this career mode anyway is fresh. It feels like they all have a different feel. Like Whether last round or the last uh, career mode even, um, with Bailey Wilson, it just felt like they was all the same. Like They was just chins until we smack them and they get knocked out. Like, this one, it feels like we're going to have to be a little bit more tactical about how we fight. And uh, I'm, I'm down for that. It's going to be an interesting career. I'm just going to have to box. I'm going to have to fight very, very smartly. And I feel like that is the difference in this career. Eh? Good first round, though. I'll take that. I'll take that. We had a nice first round there against Griffin. We're going again. I Personally, I feel like we won that round. I don't know. I feel like the jab work for Jose has been a lot nicer. Jumping him with that nice left there. He's been countering him as well. He's been coming in, trying to, trying to do some shit. And Jose has just been slipping the shots, just like that. Nice free piece there. Here we go. We're seeing Griffin on the defense now. We're trying to switch up the game plan. I've got another game plan for Louise with this dude. But um, I don't really want to kind of brawl with him. I kind of just want to try and outbox him. And if it goes to a decision, it does. I'm trying to get a win no matter what, man. I don't care if we have to knock him out. We have to get a decision. I don't really care, man. I'll just as long as we get that W and progress in the rankings, I don't really care. Here we go. Holding on nicely. Nice left hand there, though. Countered in there. Beautiful. Jose's boxing smart here, man. He's going to need to because this dude's a giant. <laughs> He's got really long arms too. Jose Luis, a bit like a T-Rex, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> okay. Flipping the body. Maybe the knockout will come late, I don't know. But just in case it doesn't, I'm not bothered, you know. This dude always overextends as well. And that's usually when we catch him slipping with a counter punch. So I'm going to just wait. There we go. Like that. Just like that. He overextends quite a lot. Nice uppercut there. And a straight. Beautiful combination there. Got tagged a little bit, but there you go. Having to fight on the outside here. Nice jab. Rolled that jab over. That was nice. Now pushing forward. I'd say it's another round for Jose. Let me know down in the comments what you're scoring in this fight so far. It's usually these fights where they're a little bit closer. I tend to lose. Nice. Nice, there we go. Jose Luis starting to pour it on a little bit. Starting to go to town. That jab has been his best weapon so far in this fight. Just clipping him with that jab. Moving forward, slipping nicely. Halfway through the fight. And uh, Jose Luis, I'd say, is winning. It's that jab, man. Nice, there we go. And then counters. Shot to the body. Dude's definitely got a good chin. Definitely. Nice three jabs there. This guy. I'm going to land it straight to the body. Nice. Okay. See him coming in there. Just tried to crack him with that uppercut. Oh, he's hurt. Let's go. This is where it's time for Jose to go to town. Griffin, though, beautifully blocking these shots. Okay. We're not going to be able to drop him there. That's fine. That's fine. Now we know we can crack him. We can do it all the time, you know? Nice left. This is the problem when you're fighting like a taller fighter. Oh, we got him again, though. He goes down. Jose Luis, beautifully timed, beautifully timed patience, has landed him this K or this knockdown KO. He isn't, he isn't out yet, but there you go. Nice boxing. I've got to say, like, the way that we're boxing, we're actually fighting smart for a change, and we're, we're kind of not rushing in. We're just... We're letting him come to us a little bit. We're leading with the jab. We never really lead with a jab in a career mode, like this much anyway. So I'm kind of glad we are. Griffin's starting to land, though. The knockdown is definitely going to give us this round, but... I'm going to go to the body there. I do want to brawl with him, but I know this, this dude isn't going to go away quietly. So I kind of want to keep some stamina on reserve, just in case... We need to go six rounds, so. There should be ten rounds very soon, I believe, when we break into like a certain rank. 
It's 10 rounds, I believe. I don't really know it works, but... And then, obviously, 12, uh, 12 rounds is a title fight, so... Nowhere there yet, though. We need to uh, we need to beat these guys first, convincingly. And that's what we're doing. I feel like we're just outboxing them. We're not rushing. We're just taking our time. And it makes for an interesting fight, man. I know this dude, he is hard to hit. He's very, very tall. Okay, there we go. We've got 10-8 on all three of the rounds on Teddy Atlas's scorecard. So we just keep going. Good shot. Stick him with that jab. If you guys see when he backs up, I kind of try to land because he does drop his hands when he leaves and tries to back up. So uh, we're looking to land some shots there. There we go. Nice hook there. I haven't really landed that many hooks. Because this dude is so tall, I don't really want to risk missing and wasting stamina. I kind of just want to hit him long. Nice shot to the body there. That was nice. Banging up the body there to Griffin. Again, when he leaves, like, when he leaves and backs up, he has his hands down. So I'm looking to stick him with that jab a little bit. Nice. Okay. Boxing well, though. I quite like this career mode, man. I'm not going to lie. Like, he's human. He's human. We've seen him rocked. We've seen him hurt in the amateurs. Professional, he's done okay. He's human. It's going to be a very interesting career mode. And I can't wait to see how it unfolds. E even the losses, man. I'm excited to get beat. I, it sounds stupid. Oh, big straight there from Griffin. I'm excited to get beat, man. I just want to see who, who does it, you know? And it makes for a more interesting storyline when we do come up short. Just jab, there we go. Backing up, see that? That was beautiful. Nice straight clips in there. Just trying to move well. Lovely head movement there. Got us out of trouble. Just jab. He's got nice movement as well, though. He baits us in, and then we throw... And then he tries to come back. He's a little bit of a counter puncher. I know this dude is an outside fighter. But when he overextends like that, we do end up catching him. Stamina wise, he uh I think it's about even, I'd say. Not straight. Now I can throw a lot more in these kind of fights compared to a 12 rounder, just because I mean it's a six rounder. I mean we can just empty the gas tank in the later rounds. Maybe that this round coming and round six, I'm just gonna go for him. And we'll see how that goes. Maybe we'll get the knockout. I don't know. Just like that. Landing these shots. I'm trying to back him up. We've got this round and obviously round six to do it. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. That shot would have hurt, man. I'm glad I slipped that. He's throwing like a looping right hand there. Here we go. Oh, nice hook. That's what we want. We're backing him up. I can land that uppercut too. Landed a lot on the gloves, though. We don't want that. We want to hit him clean. Nice right hand there. Let's go. Got him pinned on the ropes here. This is where we want to be. Nice overhand. He's starting to turn. Jose. He's having none of it, man. He's saying, nah, bro. Get back on them ropes. He's backing him up here. This is what we want. Oh, we got disconnected from Xbox Live. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Ripping these shots. Good round for Jose again, man. I don't know if he's won every round. I'd say so, maybe. Look at that jab. Just pushing him back with that jab. Trying to just land. We're getting hit quite a bit coming forward like this, though. And that could go in his favours, obviously, to the judges. Oh, a big shot there, though. But Jose just takes it. He hasn't got a glass chin, necessarily. He hasn't got a solid chin. We've seen him hurt a few times, but he rocks Griffin here. And this could be a bad thing for Griffin. He gets clipped again, and he goes down in the fifth. Is it enough? Is it enough? He's going to stay up. He's going to get up straight away from that. Like, it didn't even bother him. It was like water off a duck's back. What, why have I said that? Why have I said that in a fight night video? I don't know. It just came to my mouth, man. I should be a commentator. I really should. <laughs> Tried to slip in there. Landed a lot of shots at range, and that could be a problem. We clipped him there with a nice straight. Every time he comes in, we usually crack him with that straight. And I feel like that's what's rocked him the last two times. We're going to go again, 2% recovery that time, because we literally just went at him. And we're going to do that again for this round. I'm going to try and get the stoppage in the last round. That's what I want. I want that KO. And this is what we're after. This dude's higher ranked than us. Jose Luis has put on a show this work man we can just empty the gas tank and that could be a problem for Griffin 
because we are pushing a pace, man. I know it's the last round, but oh, he's hurt. That, that's, that's the good thing about having this stamina late in the fight, man. We can literally just push. There's no more rounds after this one, so we can push for that knockout. And that's what we've just done there. We pushed for that knockdown. We got it. Griffin, I feel like he's going to get up. And then I feel like we can put him back down. Griffin beats the count for the third time. He's got some heart, man. But Jose Luis is coming at him like he's possessed. We've got to watch out, though. Because he hasn't got the greatest of chins. We're going at him, though, man. No fear. No fear for Griffin. Let's go. And that could be a bad, bad thing for Jose. Could you imagine? We get clipped and knocked out. Going at him here, man. I've got to give credit to Griffin, though. What a fight. We'll land some big shots here. Really, really trying to just open him up. Land a big, big shot. And stun him. No head movement. Just coming forward. We've got a minute to drop him. I don't think we can do it. Oh, he's hurt. Yes, we can. He's done. Could that be all she wrote in the last round? Jose Luis, a big left, pierces the guard. And is that enough? Is that enough to score a knockout win in this one? He doesn't beat the count. Jose Luis' game plan is perfection. Wears him down later in the fight. Gets the knockout. That We planned that. We planned that win. And we've done it. Crazy, crazy win tonight. Jose Luis with a very, very big win. He's fought some opponents that are very higher up in the rankings than him. And he has come up with a big win here. Another big win in his career. 5-0 now with four knockouts. That was a very, very good record and a very, very good fight, man. We outboxed that dude. We weared him down. And in the last round, when we had a lot of stamina to go, we just went for it. And we ended up getting the KO because of it. So now we're ranked 33. That's kind of weird because that was meant to be a high-ranked fight. But yeah, we got some other guys here. I'm going to let you guys... If there isn't a message, uh, there might be. Let's have a look. Grant wants to sponsor you. Hey, I've got a pick for you. What, what, what ranking is this dude? Sergi Fletcher. Did you sleep with Sergi Fletcher's girl or something? Bro, what the hell? <laughs> okay, so this dude is ranked where? 34? So I'm actually higher ranked than him. Like, what's the point fighting him then? I don't understand. Okay, so what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to let you guys decide the next fight in this legacy mode, what you want to see in the next video. We've got Brett James. We've got Max Castro. Roderick Lacey. Sergi Fletcher. Guy Lawrence, uh, Severin Griffin, I think, yeah, that's dude, that's dude, uh, the dude we just beat, so any of these guys, maybe rank 30, he's a conventional guy, 6 foot 2, Max Castro as well, let me know down in the comments who you want to see us face off against, what I am going to do though guys is end today's video here, thank you so damn much for watching, if you have enjoyed today's video, smash that like button, comment and subscribe, and I will see you for more Fight Night Champion next time, stay awesome guys, have an amazing day, and I'll see you all again in the next one.